Hi, this is Richard here from the evohomeshop.co.uk. Today I'm just going to show you a BDR91 and how to wire it. So a BDR91 is wired in different ways depending on the Eva Home system you have, but it has some quite similar um, capabilities. So if you have a look on the left hand side, um, what you'll see is you have a neutral and you have a permanent live. Okay, so this is 230 volts. You put your neutral into the N terminal and you put the 230 volts into the L terminal. If you are using 230 volt switching, which some boilers use, other boilers don't, so you do have to consult manufacturer's instructions. If you are using 230 volt switching, what you do is you put a link wire, so you can use a brown piece of wirelet, and you put a link between the second L terminal and the A terminal over here. Okay, the A, B and C, what do they mean? So this device uses a, a, a single pole double throw switch. So a single pole double throw switch basically means when it's off, um, the terminals A and C are connected and when the relay is powered, so the green light on the relay box, terminals A and B are powered and C um, is no longer powered. So A is what we call a common terminal and C is what they call a normally closed terminal and B is what they call a normally open terminal. So what happens is, is when the relay is powered, the, the 230 volts goes into A through the switch in the relay and then when it's powered, it powers the normally open um, contact closed. So the power then goes from A to B, which then gives you your switching. So if you're wiring up a boiler that re requires a 230 volt switch live, what you do is you wire the B terminal, uh, wire from this to the 230 volt switching live on the boiler. If you don't have a 230 volt switching um, boiler, what you do is you don't put the link wire in between the second L terminal and the A terminal. What you do is you leave that wire, or you don't put one in there, and then what you do is you wire the low voltage um, in a separate cable, so like a two core cable or something like that, you wire that to the A terminal and the B terminal and back to the boiler on its low, th it should have two low voltage switching um, terminals. And then what that does the same thing, so you get the low voltage coming on A and then when the relay is powered, the normally open contact closes and you get power then, very low voltage power um, out of the B terminal back to the boiler. I hope that helps. If you have any other questions about the Honeywell Eva Home BDR91s, please contact us at technical at the evahomeshop.co.uk or comment on the video below. Thanks for watching.